Hello friends, so today we're gonna discuss the problem A from Code Forces round 661, problem name Remove Smallest. So you're given an array A consisting of n positive integers. In one move, what you can do, you can choose two indices i and j such that the absolute difference between the ith and the jth number should not be more than equal to 1 as you can see in this expression. Now you can remove the smallest of these two elements. If the two elements are equal then you can remove any of them. Okay so like both of the elements can be same then the absolute difference them equal to 0 then you can remove any of them. If the difference between them is equal to 1 then you can remove the smallest one. Your task is to find out the is it possible to obtain the array consisting of only one element using several such of these moves okay so now you can you have understand you have t queries let's move down to the test cases to make it more clear so as you can see in the first test case you can remove these two elements and after the removing these two elements like from choosing this as a pair remove the smallest one now you have remained with this pair after this pair you can remove the smallest one again because they are equal you can choose any of them and then only one element is remaining in the whole array so this is possible to make this whole array equal to 1 but in this as you can see the difference between these two is equal to 2 so you can remove this you can't remove this you can remove this the smaller one can become 4 like now it is remaining only 4 you can now choose these only 4 is remaining so 1 and 4 will remain and you cannot again make it smaller equal to 1 so the answer is no so now you can understand that you can easily sort the whole array after sorting the whole array you can just check over the consecutive numbers if the consecutive numbers if every consecutive number has a difference of less than or equal to 1 if the absolute difference then you can do this uh, like make this array equal to 1 size of 1 else you cannot do this so that's the whole logic let's move down to the code part take the input of all the n numbers and then sort them after sorting them iterate over every consecutive number if the absolute difference between the consecutive number is less than or equal to 1 then continue because there is no problem you can remove the elements else what you can do you else if this condition is not like met you have to see out no because you cannot make the whole array equal to 1 of size 1 else if you don't hit this condition you don't return out you finally print yes I hope you understand the logic as well as the code. If you still have any doubts, please mention down. Thank you for watching this video. I'll see you in the next one. Keep coding. Bye.